Hey guys, welcome back. I cannot believe it. It is time for the Partners in Cream Project Pan finale. I love this project. This is one of my favorite project pans that I am doing. If you do want to see other project pans, check out my project pan playlist. I will link that in the description box along with the info for this project, which was created by Daylin and Steph Lyons. They are amazing and they had such a great idea to create this project and it is going to restart up again in the new year in January. And this is definitely something I plan on doing again. I love this project. The whole point is to use up liquid and cream products because those are the ones that expire the fastest. So I think it's a great concept. I really, really enjoy it. I don't have empties this time, but I'll do a bit of a recap and tell you about the empties that I've had through this year long project. If you're interested in the makeup I'm wearing, I filmed this look for the Reviving Old Palettes playlist. Check that out. And yeah, let's just get started. Oh, one other thing I wanted to mention is stay tuned because at the end of every year, I like to do a year long makeup empties video. You can find my other ones in my empties playlist. So hopefully at the end of the month, that will be coming. All right, let me show you what I had left in this project. So ColourPop Flexitarian Highlighter. I've actually made really good progress on this. I figured I wasn't going to be able to finish it, but I'll show you a comparison photo and yeah, I'm really happy with how I did on this highlighter for sure. So I'm gonna hold off on using it for a little while, but we'll see, this may show up in a future project pan. So stay tuned for that. Then I had the NYX Bear With Me Tinted Skin Veil. This I was really hoping to be able to finish, but I didn't. I don't have a lot left though. So I'm hoping that I could finish this this month still because this is like pretty much all that's left. I really enjoy this and apparently they're getting rid of this, which is sad. At least it's hardly at Ulta anymore. So that is unfortunate, but I'm hoping I could still finish that. I also had the AOA liquid concealer left and this, I do have quite a bit left of this. There is 0.34 ounces in this. There's no way I could finish this by the end of the month, but again, this may be something that shows up in a future project. And then the last item I have good progress on, but I did not finish it. That is the Kylie Lip Liner and Iced Latte. I actually really like this lip liner. I think it is nice. So here we go. That is where I was before. This is where I am now. Definitely, I mean, really, really good progress on this. So I figured I wasn't gonna be able to finish this because I only put this in, I think a few updates ago, but I'm really, really happy with my progress on these items. And I'm actually hoping this I could still finish hopefully this month. So yeah, this one I'm still hoping that I could finish this month. We'll see how that goes, but yeah. Stay tuned for that empties video. Now, I did want to just give a bit of a recap because I kept a list of everything that was in this project. So let's see, this was a year long project and I had a total of 13 empties, which is pretty exciting. One of them was a face cream, two full size lipsticks, one face primer, three foundations, three lip glosses, two setting sprays, and one liquid highlighter. So those are the things that I did finish in this project pan throughout this year. And I think that's really, really exciting. Even though I don't have empties this month, I had quite a few empties throughout the year and I'm really, really happy about that. So I love this project pan. I think it is a whole lot of fun. I'm still gonna be working on this hopefully to be able to finish it soon. But I think the other three items I'm gonna hold off for now and maybe put them in a future project pan. We'll see how that goes. So let us know if you guys are going to do this project in the new year. Like I said, I think this project is a whole lot of fun. I really, really enjoy it. And 13 empties for the year just for this project, I think is actually pretty good. Um, I am doing other project pans as well. So obviously I have more makeup empties than just that. But yeah, I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. I cannot complain. That is it for this update. 
pretty short because I don't have new empties this month, but I'm still excited about the progress that I made on the items that were left in this project. And I'm excited that I did finish 13 items in this project throughout the year. Again, I do plan on doing this project again. So if you want to do it, you definitely can. Just reach out to the creators and I'm pretty sure that they can add people to the playlist. The info will be in the description box. I'm very excited. And if you wanna see the makeup look, I did film that. So I will link that in the cards and in the description box. You can check out my Project Pan playlist. Stay tuned for more because more finales should be coming in the next few weeks. And also I'm really excited to do the year long makeup empties video. So I'm hoping to finish a few more things before that. Maybe that NYX tinted skin veil. We'll see how that goes, but that is it. Let us know how you did on this project. I know that a lot of you guys did this one as well. That is it. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.